Okay, cool. Three, two, and. Well, Derek, you can see I'm in rain, bad inclement weather down here at the RBC Heritage. And, uh, of course, play was suspended today uh, because of this weather. And uh, they, the morning crew got their rounds in. Uh, McGirt, who was 500 on yesterday, well, he was plus five today. He's at even par. But the afternoon crew went out today, uh, got about five, six, seven holes in. Matter of fact, Jim Frick played seven holes. He is at two under par. Tommy Ganey's still at plus one. They will try to play tomorrow, resume play. But as I look at the radar, uh, our own Henry Rottenberg will tell us uh, probably that rain is still going to be right here in this area throughout tomorrow. Matter of fact, late on tonight, they're expecting heavy rain down here in Hilton Head. Uh, and now the question is, will they be able to get all these uh, holes in? Well, the minimum is 54 holes. They have to have 54 holes in before they can uh, rule a winner. Uh, they go down to New Orleans next week, so they got to try to get golf in. But I don't think, just in my own opinion, that they're going to be able to get uh, golf in tomorrow because rain is going to be consistent throughout the night, heavy at times, all day tomorrow. So we don't know if uh, we'll be able to get some golf in uh, on Saturday. So, unfortunately, I talked to Joe Rice, owner of the Rice Quarters right here on this boat. He said this has been the worst rain uh, weekend that he's seen down here at Hilton Head. And he's been coming here for over 20-something years at this tournament. He said there's been bad winds at times, but this rain, he's never seen anything like the rain. As you can see behind me, it's coming down uh, quite well right now. So uh, I don't know uh, what tomorrow's going to bring, but based on the radar, it doesn't look really good here for the RBC Heritage on, on tomorrow. One thing I talk about is the economy. Uh, the quarter deck over to my left, that place is usually packed, outside bands, a lot of people out there having a good time, enjoying this weekend. Well, it's been very quiet today and on yesterday. So uh, you start to think about all those folks that make a lot of money for this week at the RBC Heritage. Well, you got to believe that that's not happening uh, here this week based on this inclement weather. So we're going to be here all weekend long. I'll have updates as best as I can uh, from the course. Didn't, wasn't able to get any video tonight due to the weather uh, because it was kind of in limbo, if you will. Uh, so I didn't get any uh, video from some of the players, but uh, we'll be out there tomorrow. We'll be there Sunday trying to bring you some good coverage from the RBC Heritage. But based on what we're going through right now, and thank God for my Watch Fox raincoat because I need it today. And as I said, I'm off the back of the uh, rice quarters here, right here in the marina. But uh, you can see this is, uh, this is not letting up. Matter of fact, it is getting worse. So we'll see. We just got to stay tuned. Keep it locked right here on Watch Fox. Uh, on our website, you can follow me on Twitter at Pastor Payne. I'll be updating you as best as I can from the RBC Heritage. So uh, hopefully we'll get at least 54 holes in, but I don't expect um, a play tomorrow. I think we're going to be rained out again tomorrow. Maybe they can catch up on Sunday. And I even talked to one of the guys here. They think that it's going to go over into Monday before they declare a winner here at the RBC Heritage. That's all I got. Hope you guys are dry back home in Columbia. Uh, it's beautiful down here, but right now, not today, based on this rain and this inclement weather. But we are here trying to get you the uh, up, updated coverage. That's what we do. Uh, have a good time back in Columbia. We'll see you back here uh, tomorrow with uh, updates on what's going to happen uh, for the round on Saturday. I'm Corey Miller, Pastor Payne, live from Rice Quarters right here in the marina at Hilton Head Island, the RBC Heritage. Watch Fox News.